Lincoln Street Media, and we're sitting in front of my, well, new to me, 2000 Civic Si. If you don't know what we do, well, I don't know if I could help you there. 68,000 subs later, if you're not on board with what we do, I think, uh, I think you should just go check us out. So, um, I don't know if y'all know, I had a 2003 B6 A4 before it was an Audi. It was lowered, front mounted air cooler, 1.8T, loved it to death. The car ended up crapping the bed, started sucking and cooling on cylinder number two. So instead of putting another $2,000 into it, um, I just said screw it and uh, I ended up picking up this. So I found it on Craigslist, it was out in the city, uh, our, our local city. Guy had it up there for like 4200 bucks. It was sitting in his garage. It was a southern car originally. Never registered it, never touched it. Put the rims and tires on and put it up on Craigslist. So I'm scrolling along, scrolling along, and I'm like, holy crap, I've never liked the Civic this much. Literally that day, I go out to see it. I asked for a pre-purchase inspection. He goes, let's go right now. I go, awesome completely clean, car's amazing. I go, all right, this is it, this is done. This is my car. Hand him the $4,000 cash that day, walked out with it the next. So right now the car has an Apexi header with a full Apexi, Apexi exhaust system all the way back. And that's about it besides these gorgeous coning rims. They are the roller rims and they are the only four lug rims that I think actually look decent. <laughs> But otherwise the car's completely stock, stock intake, stock motor, but eventually I am going big turbo, forged internals, straight cut gears in the trans, and diff, uh, higher final drive ratio, bigger exhaust piping, all the way back from the headers. So she's gonna be, uh, she'll be burning rubber very, very soon. So, um, our YouTube channel started off, funny enough, as a throwaway channel. Me and Ross started off, what, almost five years ago now, maybe even more, as literally an outlet. Just to, if we're bored, let's go make a video, put it on YouTube. So, after about a year of doing that, we made four or five videos, nothing really happened, so we just kind of left the channel by the wayside, went on with our lives. About a year, year and a half after that, we came back to it, and we're like, let's just do a full reboot. Let's get this channel going, let's see what we can make of it. And ever since then, uh, I think it was the video of the old guy yelling at us, where I was on my 85, and Ross is on his 125, and that's what really sparked it. Cosmic, cosmic, cosmic.